Decision Plus has been and still is a leading stock market service provider. From training to coaching, we cover it all. Try both our software as well as our coaching site completely free for 10 days without obligation. No credit card is needed to sign up for the trial. The trial subscription will be automatically canceled for you at the end. DecisionPlus.com, your stock market service center. Real-time coaching has been created. We search and classify critical reports and technical movements. You can visualize or hear the best buying and selling opportunities. Get real-time advice all day long and three live coaching shows per day. Let us do the work and save your time for trading. Try MarketGurus.tv free without obligation for 10 days in the menus above. Market Vision Plus is the trading companion of so many investors. Make your fundamental and technical analysis easy with Canada's number one stock market decision making software. Research, decide, and follow your positions with Market Vision Plus. See the menus just above this program and try Market Vision Plus for 10 days without any obligation after the show. When it comes to day trading, Trader Plus is the right tool. Track 50 quotes simultaneously, create dozens of quick lists, display as many as 30 real-time intraday charts at the same time. Watch the action with candlesticks or bar charts as fast as 10 seconds. See the market by sectors. Use the chart models already prepared for you. Try Trader Plus for 10 days in the menu above without any obligation. Good afternoon, everyone. Welcome to the Swing Trading Show. Tuesday, October 30th, 2015. We have some funny market because the market opened on the downside and then came right back up. And we're about at zero right now on the NASDAQ. It's 0.5 point, so it's not much. And only 10 points on the Dow Jones and still negative on the TSX. Only two sectors are going up right now, consumer discretionary and the staples. Oh, uh, three actually. <laughs> but, you know, it, it's not going anywhere. It was just uh, like it opened on the downside and then we had a rebound. And there are a few sectors that, are, that seems to be pretty weak again. Uh, and, of course, there are important sectors like the financials that are coming to test again this multiple supports and uh, also the industrials that went down and uh, usually it's one of the first sector that's going to rebound strongly and it's not doing that and uh, and all of the resources failed this morning like yesterday the crude oil fell five percent and this morning it was falling again until uh, until it come back right after the opening and right now, it just seems like it's going to go down again. So I, we don't know exactly what had provoked this big rebound at the opening. And, uh, but uh, right now, I mean, the, the market is trying to find himself a direction. Uh, there are a few indicators that are coming out this week. But we still believe that uh, we, we are going to have some correction this week. So... Um, you know, it, 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 it's pretty a bad day today uh, to open the, um, some um, um, uh, to open some uh, long position because uh, we we don't have uh, any direction. If you look at the market. Uh, first of all, there was nothing in the news. There was the commercial balance with a balance in the, uh, in uh, uh, China and uh, with not much changes. 
and uh, there, there was the, the ZEW uh, index in Germany that was going down, and that's all. I mean, the, fir uh, the, the sheet is empty, so uh, n n n n nothing happened in the news, so, uh, uh, and we're wondering why. So far, technically-wise, when we look at the markets, uh, we believe this could be, uh, again, as we thought like, so last week, we believe uh, this is a top. And, uh, and and on the Dow Jones, it's quite the same. And on the SPY also, it, it, everything it looked like a top. Okay, it could be different, but whenever it happens, we'll see what's going to happen. It, it may uh, uh, break out or break down. If we have to choose one direction, we'd say it should be on the downside, but we never know, you know. Uh, the, there's one thing that is for sure is that the volume is really decreasing right now. Uh, on the SPY, even the Dow Jones, you can see the, 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 uh, the slope is very clear here in the diminution of the volumes. And uh, so uh, on, uh, during the sideway market, which is normal, and uh, even on the TSX. So the market is really sideways. Uh, we, we, we are very far from having the volatility that we, that we used to have for, for, for many weeks now. So, uh, and uh, that's the reason why we think the market is, very, is uh, looking uh, at, at a new direction. The market is waiting for something to happen. So it's, so it's pretty tough at this point in time to do anything. You know, like all of the increase that we had uh, since uh, the beginning of, of uh, October uh, has been uh, a cause. Uh, by uh, the, uh, the, 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 the fact that they, they said that uh, the jobs were bad in the U.S., so there won't be any interest rate. They, they keep saying the interest rate will increase and they will not increase, and the market goes on and off with, with uh, up and down, uh, um, uh, assuming uh, someday it's going to go up and someday it's going down. It's going to go down. So, I mean, uh, there's not much we can do. We we cannot uh, invent invent uh, um, movement because there are no movement right now on the market. So we'll be back in a second. Uh, uh, soon, um, uh, I will open you uh, the. Uh, oh, okay. You know what I will do. You know what I will do. The the, the question bar is open right now. Okay, so um, and uh, I, I'd like you uh, to uh, type in the uh, question bar right now. You have to. You just have to click in the question bar and, and say yes. I, I want to know. Exactly, because you know the the show happened on the same channel. So those that were there in the French show, uh, sometimes they just don't close their window, and we don't know exactly if you're there or listening or not. So I'd like you to click in that bar and just type anything like yes, uh, you know, or whatever. I'm there, uh, whatever. So I would like. Okay, thank you very much, uh, Palator. So uh, now I can see that you are there. So I just want to count the number of person that are really there listening to me so oh th thank you it's very nice see i like you and uh, when you when uh, when i am asking something and you do that and um, it's fun having a technology like that and i'll tell you for which reason i want to do this <laughs> later and um so, um, uh, because uh, uh, we keep uh, discussing about that here, and uh, sometimes it's uh, and it's uh, uh, very uh, difficult uh, to know uh, exactly uh, the, the the same reason the uh, the the number uh, of attendees since we are doing it on the same channel. So, um, and, uh, and 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 this is a. Uh, um, uh, is much easier to count this way. Oh, we have a movement on the gold right now. Uh, it just happened uh, while we were saying that. Uh, you can see the movement right here. And uh, I, actually, this morning, uh, the gold uh, uh, never uh, went down. You know, it started up um, uh, right at the beginning while the gold stock went down. So at the opening, when the when the gold when the when the when the when the gold stock went down, we presumed that it was going to go up right away. 
you know and uh, but uh, it, while uh, the, the gold is uh, is is staying now stable it's the gold stock that are catching up but there is one sector that keeps going down it is the uh, f uh, financial so while the financial uh, and, and you have something that uh, to be watched there. You have the symbol F A Z, which goes up when when the uh, financial uh, sector uh, goes down. So uh, and uh, it could be interesting because the financial sector is uh, is really showing a top right now. And I think if it starts uh, going down here, it won't it won't stop until it reaches the support. And uh, the, the industrial sector is, is quite the same, except that there is no uh, tool as much fun uh, to play the, uh, the uh, industrial sector down. Right now, it is mostly the railroad uh, stocks that, that brings the, the uh, sector uh, down. And uh, but you know, uh, and uh, there is another sector where we should uh, worry a little bit uh, uh, is uh, the mining sector, uh, as the mining sector has reversed its uh, last uh, bullish uh, uh, cycle. And uh, I don't know exactly why the sector has been so tr so strong uh, last week, but uh, it's cl it's clear right now that this uh, movement is over i'm gonna watch see uh, if we have uh, 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 some uh, questions in there also because it's nice that you have answered what i asked you and uh, but i want to know uh, i have to answer uh, of those uh, question to uh, our ric what is ric Oh, Richmond Mine. Okay, um, uh, Andre is asking: uh, Is uh, 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 Richmond Mine a, a good buy? Uh, it, it would, it would. But you know, uh, this this resistance is is so important. Uh, this is a one-year chart that we have right now. It's been test uh, tested multiple times, and recently, far, starting from a double top, uh, from a double bottom. Sorry. And then we, we made another bottom higher. And now we have another bottom higher. It just, it seems like it's going to break out sooner or later. But when? It could take, could take days, could take weeks uh, to do that. But it is a very important resistance. And I think it's worthwhile to be watched. But not right now. Only whenever it breaks out. Find answers to your questions by emailing your host at btm at decisionplus.com. Five good reasons to manage your investments with National Bank Direct Brokerage. Commission fees fixed at $9.95 anytime for all clients and starting at only $6.95 for active investors. No administrative fees if you hold at least $20,000 in your accounts. Registered accounts available in U.S. currency. Powerful tools to help you manage your portfolio. Award-winning customer service and satisfaction levels amongst the highest in the industry. To learn more, visit nbdb.ca or call us now. Real-time coaching has been created. We search and classify critical reports and technical movements. You can visualize or hear the best buying and selling opportunities. Get real-time advice all day long and three live coaching shows per day. Let us do the work and save your time for trading. Try MarketGurus.tv free without obligation for 10 days in the menus above. So um, the reason why I asked you to type that in the question bar is it was to confirm that uh, we had a, 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 a very low audience in English. And uh, this is the reason why this is the last week that we are going to produce this show in English. We will have it on the Wednesday only not the other day of the week because it's not worth uh, the all what it needs uh, to do that with all of the personal and everything uh, to maintain uh, the uh, the show uh, in uh, the uh, Shakespeare language so um, and uh, unfortunately uh, it is a business decision 
and uh, for the, the normal days, like five days a week, only the uh, French show is going to produce starting next Monday. But we'll do it every Wednesday. And uh, so thank you for answering. And uh, uh, did I have an, uh, another question here? Uh, yes, uh, what, what are the supports uh, for the SPY? Oh, the, the, the SPY? It's, it's very, there are many. Okay, you said uh, what are the supports. So there's one here at 200. And it, after that, it's not clear. Of course, uh, the, the 187 is another one because it's very obvious that it is there. In between, we could consider another one there. But I think, you know, I, I think if we pass the 200, it's because we're going down there uh, at the bottom. And uh, but it, but but right now, you know, it's just like uh, 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 flipping a uh, fl fl flipping a coin uh, to find out which side it's gonna go. You know, uh, we don't have any crystal ball, so we cannot say. Uh, my feeling is that it's going to be on the downside, but I can be wrong. And uh, but uh, no matter, we have to wait to see the new bullish cycle or the new bearish cycle in order to take our decisions so um and uh and 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 but if it's on the downside especially on the nasdaq market uh let's go let's go here well where is it again i didn't find the but uh, the, uh, the, the, the TVX and the uh, QQQQ still interesting because they're the beta bro to play, to play the market down. But, you know, and uh, it would be premature uh, to do so right now because, you know, I think we have one chance out of two to find out where the market is going to go right now. It seems to be uh, uh, better, uh, but uh, you know, uh, if you look at the uh, at, at the index now, as the gold is going up, it just doesn't show that uh, we have other sectors that are going down. Because while we were talking, the financial sector kept going down. So I I think it's possible, uh, very possible, that uh, the market come back down this afternoon because it's now the gold that's holding it because the uh, the crude oil came right back but you know at the moment there's no buyer on the sector anymore and consumer discretionary could have been just a temporary movement because it came from m mostly all of the stocks with a very little increase just like if we if, if if the institutions wanted to save something in in taking small position uh, um, uh overall in the stock so i think right now there are two very important sector to watch is the financial and the industrials because they're key sectors you know and right now they look like <coughs> sorry they are going to take the lead uh, going down that is very possible for the afternoon and also uh, consumer discretionary which is very heavy in the count uh, that it could break down here and and uh, the uh, um, energy sector and also the mining sector so i don't see any strength at all in this market that's the reason why if i would choose one side i think uh, that would be on the downside that it would go. But just make sure it's the side it's going to take. Thank you very much for attending. We'll see you tomorrow.